Halt! Salt! Walt! State your purpose for being here. Kralt. Oh, we're here for Kralt, and I'm Rick. I'm Bralt. And this is the Deep Bralt. We're playing Baby's First Pokemon. Yeah, where we're beating up elephant boys. It gives you the, the tickle fingers. Got a little tickle finger elephant boys. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to beat him up with a fat face cat. Yeah, the beasting cat face. Yeah. I am actually very interested in seeing what Galarian Meowth evolves into at this point. We've seen it. No, I don't think we have. Oh, I haven't seen I've it yet. I've seen it. Okay. <laughs> I thought we, I thought we no, looked at it. No, I have not seen it yet. I'm intrigued. I'm looking little. forward to seeing it. It but has, well, it has horns. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I know it's like designed after a Viking. That's all I Okay. <laughs> Like, I know the name of it. It just kind of looks like a grown-up version of what we've seen for Galarian okay. Meowth. Fair enough. I'm intrigued, though. I haven't spent any time playing Pokemon Shield on the side just because I've been so busy with the holidays and then travel afterwards. But yeah, and also travel next weekend. Yep, yep, one more. And I'm then... going to have the week uh, the weekend. I'm going to have the apartment to myself next week. It's going to be sweet. Which yeah. means never leaving my chair and playing World of Warcraft the whole time. Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, that'll be that'll that'll be pretty cool. Um, I'm always I'm always kind of in love with like random weekends where it's like I got nothing to do. Oh, everybody's that, doing stuff. Uh, that's what I live for, man. Are you I fucking ain't? kidding me? All I ever want to do is nothing. Yeah, I'm 33 years old. Like that's all that's all I want. Yeah, just 60 years of like who fucking cares? Dude, people ask me. It's like every Monday, not every Monday, but like sometimes on Mondays every you go Monday back to work. There's a halo. Oh, sorry, what? You know, you know, you go to work on a Monday, and yep. everyone's like, "Oh, what did you do this weekend? Did you do anything this weekend?" I didn't Let me do tell a you, fucking yeah. Thing. And like, my face lights up. I'm just like, I did nothing. It was beautiful. Hmm. I didn't change out of my PJs the entire weekend. Oh yes. Actually, I'm. <laughs> I felt that feel, Ben says Sarah. I'm gonna elevate her down and then go heal, and then I'm going to elevate. start because I gotta start jumping you can through go a bunch to the, of uh, the Nurse Joy. Oh, that's here. true. That's true. I can do that. Because I, I gotta start Joy going up. through. Uh, I gotta start going through like teleporty pads and stuff. Telepads. So many people are all like, "Oh, you should do all these things this weekend," and I did so much stuff all weekend, and now I'm gonna do all this stuff all week again. And I'm like, "What's wrong with you? Yeah. <laughs> I can do Why that. do you not like to rest? <laughs> like I didn't do a fucking thing. You know, I hung out. I played video games. I read a book. It was yep. fucking great. I, I can, slept. I can do a real weekend where I go and do things like maybe ten times a year. Yeah. <laughs> No, it's like the once a month ish. Maybe. And then November Little. and December don't count because you have family things you have to do. So, like, mm -hmm. those take up the that slot. Takes up, yeah. No, I, I hear you. Maybe a little. I didn't think of holidays taking up that <laughs> spot. So, maybe a little bit less than 10 oh. times a year. Yeah, because, like, those maybe definitely like is the same amount of energy. Yeah. Right? It's yeah, the, yeah. Wow. Oh, or shit. sometimes, depending on your family. Wait, right. are we fighting <laughs> again? <laughs> Honestly, the biggest the biggest things I ever do really are like Me have a D and D session. As many times it takes. So. Yeah. Meanwhile, we're having our own conversation. We're <laughs> doing things. Look at him go. Oh Giovanni, Team Rocket. That's yeah. uh, that's Art Archer. Oh, Sterling Archer. So I'm not fighting him here. Which probably means I'm about to fight Blue upstairs again, right? Like, I fought him at the beginning, and I'm going to fight him at the end. Do you think he's going to heal all your Pokemon after? Probably. He did it last time, too. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense if they're like, and now go fight the boss. Oh! Uh, like, who's that? Oh! oh it's Team okay, Rocket! Right. I actually kind of dig. So, Pokemon Yellow, by having Jesse and James, added it's a fun. little bit more character to red and blue which is kind of nice and this one adding even more like new characters to it and bringing an archer kind of makes it feel oh a little i don't more know if i love those chibi styles of them it makes it a little bit more it's of an okay. ensemble thing which i kind of appreciate they, they have to be that way to fit in with all the other like no characters. and i get yeah. i get that that's part of the look i'm just saying i don't know if i love that hmm, look do i have them. I do have you. have you. ground moves. You fucking wreck shit. Yeah, I was just like, oh, because it's drill. Drill run doesn't have everybody. I was like, if I do earthquake, though, I don't want fucking Persian getting hit. But it's like, oh, I don't you have, have to worry to. about that. Yes. Do you have earthquake as a TM yet? Uh, I don't remember <laughs> yeah, actually. <laughs> like, look at how derpy this face. Oh is. yeah, it's awful. Oh my god. It makes me. Like some of them are sad. fine. <laughs> Some of them, it's like, yeah, okay. Look at those slightly cartoony eyes on Arbok. Like those look fine. Whatever. But the Persian face, wow. I just want to take Weezing out first because I don't want it exploding. It's actually kind of weird to see a Lolan uh, Persian 
next to all the like Gen One Pokemon yeah. because the design is a little different. It's a little bit because like yes. the first generation, you could be like, uh, how about uh, you know Cobras? You've heard of Cobras? We this is a Pokemon. Yeah, and its yeah. name is Snake Backwards. Hey. <laughs> No, uh, our, our or co- is cobra, cobra, back- cobra backwards. Sorry, wrong. That's that's the Ekans. The yeah, yeah. yeah. The uh, Ekans is snake backwards. Yeah. Arbok is cobra. Back- I don't remember like <laughs> which one is the evolved form of which. Uh, <laughs> Ekans and then Arbok. Yeah. Is that so what it is? Snake yeah. and then cobra. Snake into cobra. Yeah. Okay. But just like you could like you could just do that because it was the first Pokemon. Yeah. We yeah. One, you hadn't used up all the cool animals yet. <laughs> Two, like no one cared yet. You, you've you heard of shrews, like, right? You know how they like burrow. <laughs> sand shrew. Yeah, one <laughs> like that's, that's covered in sand. Yeah, that's it. Yep. It's back I mean, looks some like of them bricks. are a little bit more like reason. inventive, like the um Um You've heard of mimes, right? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> we got one. That's a Pokemon um, too. <laughs> yeah, that's so an these, that's like, an animal ghosts? now. Wait, shit. <laughs> um <laughs> I mean there's also just like bird. There's actually several that are just bird. Yeah, but yeah. there's specific types of bird. <laughs> Pidgey, I'm looking at you. <laughs> yeah. Like, I guess that's a pigeon, and then there's a sparrow. Pigeon, oh, that's fear, what I'm saying. Like this. But, like, they're both just birds. I'm just saying, they are very. They were <laughs> like, no, we're going to pick a bird, and that's going to be the type of bird it is. Yeah. Fear, Firo, too, right? Or yeah. No, that was the Spiro. Spiro and Firo were yeah. the same. Well, evolved. Farfetch, so. that's what I was trying to think uh, of. Oh, yeah, there was a duck, too. Now, before I go in there... Wait, there's a. Oh no, I thought that I thought Giovanni was the one saying at the desk for a quick second. I was like, "There's another new dude that's like doing stuff." <laughs> that's the chairman. Yeah, I'm not gonna fight just yet because there is. I think there's one other guy that's downstairs. Ah, uh, you know what? I'll I'll just I'll leave him. Just go. Who cares? There was like one guy that I think is in a teleport only room, and I'm just like, eh, that'll take all day. So let's let's go in and do this. <coughs> ah. Excuse me. Uh, how are our party members oh, I'm sure doing? You're fine. Oh yeah, none of them actually took any damage in that fight, so we should be all good. Ugh. I'm surprised they didn't heal you after that one very simple fight. All right. Well, I mean, I wouldn't know where. <clears throat> Excuse me, I wouldn't know right now if they had, because I ne- I didn't take any damage. So. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Well, you could look at your peepee. Oh, Let's hey guys, want to see my peepee? Who's that little girl in the corner? As the assistant, I guess. She looks like. 12. I mean, everybody one. without a beard does in this, so. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's The Master true. Ball. You successfully created one, didn't you? Wow, so th- I never really considered the, the notion that, like, Red and Blue could exist so early in the franchise's, like, timeline that Master Balls were, like, literally a, new, a brand new invention for, like, Gen 1. Yeah, although wasn't isn't this game supposed to be... Alongside well, Gen 3. Well after? <laughs> it's supposed to be well after, like, some of the events of Gen 1. Like, so this takes place in a in an altered timeline where Red and Blue both had their adventure, but it had nothing to do with Team Rocket oh. or the Master Ball or any of the actual, like, like progression stuff. Why? All right, sure, whatever. It's so confusing. There's, there why is explicitly that? no way for this game to exist within the time, the same timeline as Fire Red and Leaf Green. Why do that? Except for they're just being lazy. Oh. How dare you! Give many thought of focus to create lots of powerful Pokemon for you. Can they do that? <laughs> Wait. Uh-oh. Stolen research to create Pokemon. Wait a minute. Whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. When was that in the cards? Well, they made uh, Mewtwo. Yeah, but that wasn't Silphco, unless it now wasn't is. It? Was? Wasn't I don't think it, it was. Silphco? I don't. I mean, maybe. I think I the original think was... building. The, the notes say that they were by Silph. Well, that's in the Cinnabar Island, though, right? Oh, oh you mean the notes there say it was Silph? Maybe. Yeah. We had a it's deal. A you agreed time, to this. But... Wait, there's even more going on. What the fuck? I don't remember any of this shit from Gen One, or maybe Gen One's plot was so <laughs> like basic that you just kind of like in gen one you over. like go up here and giovanni's in the room and he's just like wow you're well, a let's tough fight. kid let's fight <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> i'm like okay <laughs> monsters <laughs> i have a grass dinosaur <laughs> ah young rickolodeon that's my new nap uh, nap name yeah that's <laughs> my new nap name the president Silva and I are discussing a vital business proposition. Keep your nose out of grown-up matters. Maybe they, to maybe they did say something like that. Where like we're discuss- I remember them saying like we're discussing grown-up things, but I don't know if oh. we ever saw what they were saying. Oh. Persian. Okay. Oh, you got a regular Persian. How'd you do that? Yeah, well, I got a wacky Persian. 
My <laughs> my head's bigger, therefore. <laughs> <laughs> therefore, I'm gonna win. Yeah. You just you just look like a cat. You just clapped at uh, me. Yep, you got your ears boxed. <laughs> Oof. Yeah. Shit hurts. Play rough. Oh, isn't that a fairy type move? It is. Okay, that was a little Let's less great. Stab. You can kill it. Yeah. <laughs> I always go for the. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it. It was like, unless it crits, then I'm not in danger. But that's like just even then enough. you're faster. Like yeah, I would have to have missed first for it to matter. Yeah. Oh yeah, I suppose that's true. I don't remember what Rhyhorn. Okay, yeah, we're definitely switching on this. Uh, I ground is good against. I think. I guess Miles is probably my best bet here, huh? Yeah. Because everybody else is either weak or like Gary would be neutral to ground, maybe weak to ground still. So I'm just gonna go Miles and then. Bubbly, bouncy, bouncy bubbles. I think you'd still be weak to ground because water doesn't resist ground. I th yeah, I think so. So rather than risk that... You'd probably be okay either way, but... Bye! Bye! I want to buy a new outfit for Oh, it's Eevee. Rhyhorn, not Rhydon. Whatever. Yeah, no, it'll be a Rhydon by the time we fight at uh, Viridian Gym. Unless Blue winds up being the Viridian Gym leader, I'm kind of curious where that no, goes. This, this Ry Rhyhorn has the stats of a foot fungus. I wonder, do you think Red is going to be at the end of Cerulean Cave with Mewtwo? Not oh, necessarily geez. having captured it, but also... He's just there. Yeah, like uh. similar to the Mount Silver fight from Gold and Silver. Bing. Bing. One like, more. Why try to like make weird connections like that when you're already disassociating yourself from the original I games? Partially, like yeah. not completely, but sorta. Who's he sending out? Uh, uh, Nito Queen. I think I'm gonna stick with this and just do Bouncy Bubble again. Yeah. Is that the one that heals? Uh, yes. Ugh, so fucking good. That one's crazy. That one, and not to mention, water has so many things that can be used against, like nicely. And Rock and Ground are so common. Water is a great attacking type. Yeah. Actually. Oh no, you want Ice Electric? Is really good combo. There's, mm -hmm. n I don't. There's really not much that Booty will slam. resist having both an ice and electric. Or I don't know. My my thought process yeah. for Pokemon <laughs> is all stuck in like Gen two. So, well, like, like my, my, <laughs> my brain hasn't like it took grown like up since seventeen then. years for them to add an eighteenth type. So, I think they modified them after Gen four or something. That's the thing. Briefly. They made changes to like what was good against what, and I'm just like, ah, I don't fucking know anymore. I think it. I'm too old to learn anything new. I think it was mostly steel that changed. Like steel lost a bunch of its resistances because they went, wow, we <laughs> kind Whoops. of overdid it there. <laughs> ah, I lost again. Hey guys, what should steel resist? Well, it is metal, so like probably everything. Yeah. <laughs> Blast! I have little choice. It seems I will relinquish silk for now. I mean, you're still an adult and could punch a kid. Yeah, and the Eevee. I never... Oh, I suppose if you did that, like, your Pokemon are still alive and your Pokemon could beat the shit out of him. That's true. So that's... We're gonna get a Master Ball I could use on a Fero? I would... Re <laughs> I would really like... Pictures of a legendary Pokemon? It's Zapdos. I own yeah, one. Yeah, I, I, I own you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I would really like to see a more, like, adult Pokemon... Careful, that's... Uh, <laughs> a cute Pokemon and a strong-looking Pokemon. You're totally right. There it is. What? That's almost certainly referring to Mew and Mewtwo. Oh, yeah, yeah. The rest is all graphs. Yeah, all right. Um, but, I, I mean, like a, like a gritty, darker Pokemon show? Yeah. Animated, of course, because I don't want to see shitty CG. Well, I want to say monsters, but uh, the there there was a new take on Pokemon that was actually a bit darker. Like, there's literally a it shot of Squirtle and Charmander fighting, and one of them bites the other one's tail. Like, yeah, they I, I I saw some of it and was like pretty good, but not quite. I wanted to like I, I would like to see a Pokemon show that like kind of readdresses the themes okay. and like how things work, you know. Okay. Where it's just like, you know, people might actually have their monsters, like, burn down houses or, like, uh, you know. Right, like, actual district. Like, why wouldn't you be able to do that, you know? Yeah, why not have your... Uh, I, don't, I don't know. Everyone's just like, okay, let's have a structured battle. Your turn. 
Yeah, my right. My turn. <laughs> like I get I and I get that that's just to represent to represent what's happening. Sure. But like at the same time it's kind of like Yeah, they're they're kind of well, missing oh, an easy opportunity to like explore what would happen if someone really just was like you, fuck everybody. <laughs> you beat my monsters. I will go now. Yeah. Yeah, no, exactly. Bing bong. Something a little bit more than just like Team Rock is trying to take people's Pokémon. I yeah. don't know. It just always seemed like Are you guys all fucking dumb? Like there's a lot that could happen when you bring into bring into reality the thought that like you can capture monsters and fight for you. Right, like literal dragons and shit. Like one day, one day we'll get it. It's like it, it may literally be like straight up decades from now, but <laughs> someday that inevitably has to be explored. It seems like a in today's gritty world, it yeah. seems like an inevitability. But if anything, I think we'd have to we'd have to wait. A little longer for like gritty reboot style stuff to be fully out of the vogue for it to be not like oh they're just cashing in and trying to do what everybody else is doing. Yeah. Your dad, you beat Giovanni, right? That Archie guy made a run for it, so I chased him all the way out here in the end. Well, the team rocket grunts ran right out of San Francisco to you. Guess we're lucky you're such a strong trainer. I love you. Here, let me give you a reach around because I'm so impressed. It's just kind of how this guy is for. That's how your, like, friendly rivals are in, like, every game now. Yeah. It's like, you're like God. <laughs> like, wow, oh. you're so good at everything. But you and me, we really managed to wow, save you, <laughs> you know type advantage? Someone did point out that he actually has a Cubone on his team now, and it's implied that the Cubone from uh, Lavender Town is now, like, did, like appreciated, oh. you know, so much how... how uh, your rival helped out that, like, it just joined him, like, of its own will. Well, good. Let's spray it with water and make it <laughs> yeah. faint. Let's drown it to death. Yeah. All right. How many badges you got? That many, huh? Wow. We didn't code in an answer for each of them. <laughs> like, <laughs> it would be so, like, ah! Uh, <laughs> low effort. Uh, low effort. I am going to go to the Pokemon Center and heal. Yeah. And we come back next time, I'm going to walk around town and talk to everybody again, at oh, least geez. outdoors, because, like, Team Rocket's gone. And uh, and we'll come back next time. We'll head to the Fighting Dojo! Hoo! 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 Hoo!